God damn it, Filmora. I tell everybody I'm done making tutorials about you, and then you sneak in an easy way to blur out someone's face using motion tracking? Stick around, I'll show you how. Son of a bitch! All you need to do is find a piece of footage of anything with a face that you want to blur that happens to be in motion. In this case, I'm using a piece of footage of me running around like an idiot in my studio. Once you have that piece of footage in your timeline, double left click on it and in the upper left under the videos tab, you will see there is an option for motion tracking. Expand that in the dropdown and check the box to make sure that it's active. Once you do that, you will see a small tracking box appears over your footage in the upper right preview window. The center plus sign will designate where that motion tracking will follow. Let's put that right on my nose and I can close that down a bit. Once I've got it where I want it, in the upper left, I just click start tracking. Filmora then does all the work for me and makes sure that that piece of footage will track my face based on the center of my nose. In the upper left, you'll see the progress bar as it completes tracking that piece of footage. And once it's done, all you need to do is go up to the drop down menu and choose add a mosaic. That will insert a mosaic blurred window over your footage in the upper right. Choose the type of mosaic you want to use. I'm going to use this more pixelated one. And then just reset the size so it covers the area that you think will be affected during your shot. Something like that ought to do it. And then hit play. If the tracking is doing what you want it to do, then you're all set. You can adjust that at any time to expand the size of it so it covers a slightly larger area. Export your footage and you are done. If you want to learn more video editing tips, tricks, and techniques, click on the video that's on screen now or the ones I'll pin down below. Peace.